what happens with these bridges. I'm gonna go. All right, I'm gonna go. That's what happens. One lane bridges are dangerous, folks. here okay so a little little damper on things here because we got a guy inside I know him but he's fixing up the place and um, the windows they're all dilapidated there were raccoons inside the place is locked but um, 1832 so he's inside fixing windows that are like 187 years old um, number two used until 1944 Made the field of cobblestones, replaced a log cabin where Caroline Phipps taught. Now they do have meetings in here and they do have people that come through here to, to look at the place. And they, they have classes to teach the history of it. Alright, let me see if we can use this box here while we're taking pictures outside. All right, spirits, are there any spirits from the Gaines Basin Schoolhouse with me? So as you can see, so as you can see, the windows are so crooked. The cobblestones are all pushing out. Pushing out. Pretty cool. This property is listed in the National Register of Historic Places by the United States Department of the Interior. Let's see if I can show you exactly how this building... Can't really see it, can you, in the video? How those windows are just pushed in, the whole building is just kind of caving in on itself. And Pete's in there and he's... He's in there and he's trying to fix all the window sills. There's some pictures that I'm going to attach to the video. There's a coal burner when you first walk in and go to the right. There's a room where they had a coal burner, a little pot belly stove. Are there any spirits that are attached to this building here that can talk to me right now? Hello. And if so, can I get your name? You should be proud of this little building. It's still standing. This might have been an outhouse. Should we open? Was this an outhouse? 
Don't open. Don't open. Don't open. Yeah, this was a little outhouse, I think. And there's some chairs in here. There's a bunch of stuff in it. The roof look I don't know if the video shows this, but that roof is so wavy. How many kids did this schoolhouse hold? Can you tell me how many kids were taught here? And what was the teacher's name? What was the teacher's name of this school? Well, what did what did you teach here? Did you teach math? Did you teach writing and reading? All right, so I'm gonna go. I don't want to bother Pete while he's working. It's locked, so I can't come in here at any other time. Looks like there's a little side door over there, which is odd. It's about as high as a window. Hmm. Are you guys happy with the work Pete's doing inside to save this place? Yes. <laughs> He's doing a great job, isn't he? You guys aren't scaring him, are you? He doesn't... <laughs> I asked him if it was haunted. He said yes with raccoons. So all the raccoons are out. They've got a grant to fix it up. He's fixing all these windows. They're all crooked. I'll show you the pictures. I can't bring the box inside because there's a fan and he's pounding and working. And I don't want to bother him or make him feel uneasy with this. <laughs> Are there any kids that were taught in this place in the area attached to this place? Did you guys live in the same town or did you have to travel to this school? Okay, so I just wanted to swing by here real quick. I wanted to do more, but I'm not going to be able to. So thank you, Spirits of the Cobblestone School, for letting me look inside and talk to you for a moment. You guys have a good day. Goodbye. Goodbye.